Howdy guys, Zarcasm here. Welcome back to another episode of Tech It. Last episode, we uh, gathered some basic supplies, found this kind of marbly cave, and uh, decided to call it home. So, in this episode, uh, we are going to go mining. Uh, again, the first couple, first early bits of Tech It are going to be just your normal Minecraft stuff. So, let's press on. I'm going to go ahead and go down this area here that we discovered that's like right under our home and we'll see where it gets us so that orange stuff there it's gonna be your copper very important it's very common though so you're gonna end up getting a lot of it Ooh, hello <coughs> we might not actually go this way since we have to drop down because I don't want to drop down if I you know can help it hopefully they can't get up <laughs> <clears throat> Just take a drink, yeah. Ah. Sorry if I sound like crap. I've got like a dry throat. So, ooh. Oh, you scared me. Okay. Um, since we're so close to our home, I'm going to throw this copper in the chest. Because we're going to be down. We're going to be down here for a while. My goal, the way I do it, is I pretty much go mining and I do not come back up until I find at least one diamond. Now I know someone's going to be like, but you need more than one diamond. You need like five. I know that. I know that. Bear with me. <laughs> I'll explain as we get there. Do, 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 do. Looks like this leads back to the outside which is good. Usually what I do, I'm not intentionally missing these ores. I'll, uh, what I do is I'll go to the end. If, if I sense that a tunnel is going to dead end quickly, I'll uh, light up the entire tunnel and then I'll just come back and get the ores on the way back. And then when I get back to the junction, I'll close off that tunnel. So that way when I'm roaming around, I don't get lost. I know a lot of people do like a torch method, put uh, put your torches on one side of the cave wall so you know which direction is back to the entrance. I've tried doing that, but to me it doesn't really work unless you're playing on peaceful because in some hallways, in some caverns rather, um, putting the torches on one side doesn't light up the entire cavern. See, like like this. See, I've got torches all on that side, but it's a little dark over here, and I'm not an expert on, like, light levels, but I would imagine that enemies could still spawn there. So, if the torch method works for you, cool. Doesn't really work for me, so I don't, I don't do it. Alright. Kappa. Gimme the kappa. Get to the kappa. Wait a minute, that don't work. Yeah, see the skeleton's not here anymore. There was a skeleton stuck on this water. Oh. Help me. Block that water off. Hello. Gotta be careful since we're not wearing any armor. <laughs> Wow, it's a lot of gravel. I don't think I've ever seen this much gravel before. What's down here? Eh, not quite a dead end. Let's head back up. Alright. Let's get the coal. Um, early on, you're going to need a lot of coal. And not just for, like, torches and uh, things like that. I mean, you're, you're going to be using a lot of coal for your fuel <coughs> until we can get a better source of power. But starting off, we're going to be using... You're going to use a lot more coal than you would normally use in Minecraft. So just bear that in mind when you're mining. Um, 
try not to ignore coal because you need it. Try not to ignore anything really. Um, if I'm getting pretty full, I mean I'll start to drop like stacks of cobble and things like that. But if I get pretty full and I am exploring around and I see some diamonds, I will go for those diamonds and then just ignore everything else because once we find diamond, I mean we're gold. So we <laughs> once we find diamond, we're gold. Once we find diamond, we're we're ready to come back up. So that's the goal right now, diamond. Hmm. Ah, see, dead end. Mine all this up. I want to find some gems because I know my my iron pickaxe isn't gonna last forever. I've easily gone through like four pickaxes even gemmed ones on a mining adventure trying to find diamond on the first mining adventure you know because you find so many other ores <laughs> doop, 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 doop. water no uh, bloop. this copper. I have a habit of looking behind me. <laughs> plenty, uh, plenty of times I'll just be standing here mining and all of a sudden ah! so it's another reason why I try to go to the end of a cavern and light it up so I don't get creeper ninja <laughs> Now, since I'm playing on hard, it is a little dangerous going down here with no armor, but I really want to save my iron. Because, I mean, to craft a full set of armor, that's 24 iron ingots. That's 24 iron ores. Well, if I wait till I get a macerator, I can turn those 24 ores into 48 ingots. And then, that way I'll come out ahead, you know? So, and if I'm lucky enough, I could just skip iron armor altogether. Which is probably what I, it's one thing I like try to go for. Now we're still pretty close to the surface. We're still at, um, hold on, let me make the mini-map bigger. There we go. Okay, so now you can see our coordinates. Um, I don't usually play at this resolution. Only when I'm recording. So, see, so yeah, you can see our, our coordinates. Uh, the, ooh, zombie. X, uh, X and Z are the two numbers that are obviously changing right now. The bottom one with the parentheses, that's the Y. Diamond level's about, what, like 10? Between 9 and 12, something like that. So, uh, that's where we're gonna be looking. But, we need to get all these ores on the way. Usually what ends up happening is I'll find diamond and I'll have no clue how to get back. And so I'll end up having to dig out. <laughs> Which is what the waypoints come in handy for, because then, you know, when you dig out, you have no idea where you are. Oh, this is a dead end. Nice. And even though it sounds... I hear a zombie on the other side of the wall, but I don't want to go for him. Because we've already seen some other caverns that has ores in them. And we can drop these off on the way. So it'll make our mining venture a little more fruitful. So yeah, uh, just just in case this happens, I'm recording a bunch of episodes all at once, so if you've commented on the first episode, um, you know, I, obviously I appreciate your comments, um, but just remember I'm recording a bunch at once, so it, it'll take a couple episodes for the, for the videos to catch up to the comments. I miss some iron. I'm missing all sorts of goodies. I love this texture pack. It's really good. I, I may start just using this texture pack exclusively. I mean, even in my normal Minecraft worlds. Because it's really nice. Uh, oh, we haven't been down here, have we? Let's go down here. Really need some gems. I don't want to make another iron pick. Oh, 
Oh shoot! Ah. Okay, we got this. We got this. Sub creepers. Sub creepers. Oh no, you don't. There we go. That's how it's done. Oh yeah, it looks like we're going. It's like we're almost heading back up. Let's go this way. Oops, spider. I swear they didn't used to jump like that, you know. Aha! See, we're coming back up to one of our junctions or one of our waypoints we marked here. Yep. Hello. So now what you can do? Go into your waypoint menu. You can actually uh, remove some waypoints. This is number three, so I'm going to go ahead and remove it. Because now we've explored it. Sort of. Now I'm going to go get these. Go through and get these ores. Oh, wait. Hold on. Before I do this, I really want to find some gems. I don't want to spend more iron on another pick. Whoop. Ah. Did he drop a bow? Dang it. Okay, do I see... Ah. Yeah, give me some more string. So I can make a bow. Oh, there's some tin down there. Whoop. Ooh, lava. That's a good sign. Don't you blow up that copper. No. Guess as long as he doesn't blow me up, I'm happy. Alright, so there's some tin, some marble. More tin. <laughs> Nothing over here. Aha! Sapphires. Yes. And emeralds and rubies. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Alright, so don't worry. We'll, we'll get all these ores. I just really need to make another pick, and I didn't want to use iron for it. And I want to light up this area here. Aha! That's uh, that green stuff here. That is not emerald. That is uranium. And so we'll definitely need as much of that as we can find. Where does this go? Hello there. Kind of a dead end, kind of not. One thing I've noticed about marble is marble is usually around hollow areas. So if you run into a dead end and there's marble at the dead end, try digging through the marble and uh, you may actually find another cavern. Kind of a drop there. <clears throat> Some more uranium. Uranium's usually in like one to two uh, deposits. Some more ways down. This is an interesting cavern. All right, gotta get some of those gems because the pick is almost down for the count. And there's some emerald. Is there enough emerald? No. Dang it, I need three. Alright, let's see if we can get up here without dying. Ah, there are three sapphires. Yay, we can make sapphire pick. Huh. Let's get down here. Alright, now let's go back to that top area where we just were. Alright, I'm gonna put the three back here, dang it. It's, I should. Oop, not 23. Okay. Now let's get the sapphire pick at the ready, because I know I'm gonna need it. Eh, yeah, the bow's not gonna do us very good. <laughs> oh, we do need more torches, though. Boom. <laughs> That'll set us for a while. Okay. Get some M 
inventory management here. Okay, now let's pick that back up. Alright, let's continue mining. Oh, there it goes. See how the sapphire picks a little faster? Very nice and handy to have. Hopefully I'll find another emerald. Or hopefully those rubies, that there's three rubies, so I'll continue to have a nice supply of uh, gemmed picks. There we go. Ooh, sorry if this is a little boring. I mean, not much we can do. This is this is what Minecraft is all about. And this is what you gotta do, especially with Tekkit. Gotta do a whole lot of mining in the beginning. Pretty much after you find at least one diamond, you'll never have to come mining again. And I know what you people are still probably saying, one diamond, what are you talking about? You need you need at least five. No, you need at least eight. Yeah. You're right, you do need at least eight for what for you know what I know I know what everyone's talking about, but you don't necessarily have to have eight. And I'll I'll show you guys why when I get that far. I'm not gonna mess with it right now. Cause then I'll just have to explain it again. <laughs> Alright, isn't that 10? 10 is, uh, it's not as common. I mean, it's pretty common, but it's not as common as copper. Um, but it, it's still just as useful, just as needed, I think. Um, don't think we're ready to go down here yet. Iron. Iron's one of those things you can't really have too much of now. I know in normal Minecraft, you know, I, I was to a point where I had more iron than since. Now it's, uh, <clears throat> I never have enough iron, it seems, for tech it. I need to find those rubies. Hopefully there's three. That way I can have another pick. Oh, what have we found here? Oh, hi there. Hello, oh, hello. Where does this go? Oh, more rubies. I see torches like we've been here before. Or that could be lava. Well, this is good. We're going further down. I like it. More emeralds, excellent. Oh, lava. Okay. Might want to make a sword as well, because this iron sword won't last forever either. Probably should have thought about bringing that wood with me. And I might when I go back, when I go back up. We'll see. Alright, emeralds. Once again, I think I only got two. Now, all the gems are the same, by the way, though. The rubies, emeralds, and sapphires, they're all the same. None of them's better than the other. Heading down more, which is good. Hopefully get lucky and find diamonds like right away. Make my day. You 
and we're still pretty close to home. Not that not that far away. It's kind of surprising. There are times I've gone hundreds of uh, blocks away from my home, just following a really intricate mine cavern, you know, intricate cave network. Oh, jeez. Come here, buddy. walking through lava. They're not supposed to do that. That their AI that their new AI kept them from doing crap like that. Oop. Now the old version of Tekkit up until up until recently it was still on Minecraft 1.1, but this version is on 125. So which should have the new AI programmed in. And I've I've obviously already seen it, but Who knows? Where are those rubies that we saw anyway? Oh, right there. There they are. Ah! Whew. Glad that wasn't a creeper. Barely saw his legs the last second. That'd have been bad. Another zombie. Hello. Ah, more rubies. That's good. Ah, a new ore. That is silver ore. Um, again, it's pretty common. It's not that rare. A little rarer than tin. Um, but quite valuable. Um, it's used in a couple of interesting recipes. Ah. So here we go. There's two uranium right next to each other. She's using some valuable recipes, but it's also worth a lot, like an equivalent exchange. Now I have enough rubies for a pick. So, ruby pick. Just be prepared. And, uh, emerald sword. Just to be prepared. Pick up that crafting table. Okay, let's let's uh, well, we'll hang. We'll start dropping junk as we need to, I guess. All right. Oops. Now, yeah, could use could still use finding one more emerald. Do we want to go down? We've missed a lot of ores up there, so call this down and I'll come back to it. Since this is a mining episode I am probably gonna have to cut it a little bit. <laughs> it's gonna make it an editing nightmare. Oh well, such is the way of things. It's this way. Another way down. There's some gold, there's some nickelite, there's some redstone. That's where we want to go right there. Ooh, there's a zombie. Some more sapphires. Spoiter. Now, nickelite is interesting. It's worth a decent amount in uh, equivalent exchange, but I've actually learned that uh, if you want to get into red power and blue tricity and all that, you want to keep your Nicolite. So I'm I'm actually going to be keeping my Nicolite. the heck's going on there? <laughs> okay. Where's our down waypoint that I just set? right there. I wonder if it goes down into this. Like another direction. <laughs> down again. Come back to that. 
Oh! They found me. Here's somebody. Oh, yeah, I bet that goes down into there. Get some more tin. Some more kappa. burned on the lava. Those rubies are still down there. I need to get those rubies pretty soon. Alright, let's come down here. More kappa. Try not to stand in the lava. Think we're okay. Think we're okay. <clears throat> Whoop. Whoop. What's going on? Oh. I dug out a block I didn't expect to. Oh. Some more down. So many ores. I'm telling you, when you first start, you're going to be mining for a long time, but you definitely have to. Pretty much mine everything until you find diamond and then come back up. Nope, oh, I'm already full. It's not letting me pick up that cobble there. I also like the just having different colored tools. I think it's kind of cool, especially in this texture pack. They uh, they look really good. Let's dig through this to the next bit. Abandoned mine shaft. Might be interesting. Um, abandoned mine. Come back to it. Ha! Another. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of rubies. Definitely, definitely take those. back here. Obviously I've been here. And I went... Oh, I didn't go this way at least. Oh, I know where I'm at. Okay. Alright, so I'm full. Let's head back up if we can. You know, it's weird. In the old version of the Sfax texture pack, the gem swords looked just like the like the iron and the diamond sword. It looked like this, only just, you know, green. And then they changed it. Don't know why. And I think the quantum armor changed as well, like in, 
in the last version it was blue and now it's green more, some more ores up here that I haven't got let's go ahead and get them in the right way. I'm trying to get back out. With some copper. Kappa. I think uh, on one mining adventure I had, by the time I found diamond I had like four stacks of copper, four stacks of iron, two stacks of tin, two stacks of redstone, like a half a stack of gold, two or three stacks of nickelite and eight diamonds oh and I think I had like a half stack of silver as well oh see dang it let's get rid of well let's get just another torch I guess that way we're not getting rid of anything There we go. Let's get out of here. All right, home's this way. So let's. Oh, I'm in home. Ha! Wow. Let's put some stuff up. This will be our junk chest. How about that? So let's get the let's get our ores back out. This will be our junk chest. The wood. Chest number one. Okay, get a double chest right here. Kappa. Look how much copper we've got so far. Let's get our tin, our iron. We have no gold, but our silver there. Let's get our coal. Our gem. Well, let's hang on to the gems. Our uranium. Uh, let's throw this marble in here. Let's go ahead and break all those down. Yippers, yippers, yippers. Okay, there we go. Uh, do I want to take all this wood with me? No, let's leave a little bit of it in here. And we'll leave the cobber. Cobber? We have a cobble in here as well. Okay, I think we're set to go back down. I'll call this up so good. Next time on uh, Tech It, we're gonna go back down into the mines, and I think we'll go we'll go deeper into that area where we saw the gold and the nickelite, and maybe we'll find diamonds. So I will see you guys next time. And I'm full. <laughs> no! Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I think that's our signal to leave. Let's get out of here. Oh my gosh. Uh, <laughs> oh, my heart's beating. My heart's beating. My my hands are shaking. I'm still getting headshots. It's like boom headshot. <laughs> I haven't heard that in a long time.